In Seb Lester's 15-second Instagram clips, he draws letters by hand where others might use a computer. The 43-year-old has gained millions of fans with this and other calligraphy videos. The sudden attention has caught the artist by surprise, but he's glad calligraphy is being recognized again. People use words like um, mesmerizing and um, hypnotic, and they just find there's a satisfaction they, a lot of people find in looking at the calligraphy being drawn. Lester lives in Lewes, a town 80 kilometers south of London. He used to work as a typeface designer for a London agency. Back then, he used a computer to create his work. His clients included major companies such as Intel, British Airways, and H&M. Four years ago, he discovered the appeal of calligraphy and traded his computer for pen and ink. Very zen, actually. You, it's quite meditative. I think it's quite a relaxing exercise if it's not driven by deadlines. Um, and um, it just feels very human, it's very natural. The art of writing by hand is going through a revival at the moment. You can find agencies on the internet that will write letters by hand for you. On Instagram, posts about calligraphy have become more than just an isolated phenomenon. And Lester is one of the most successful calligraphers on the social media platform. Meanwhile, some of his videos on YouTube have been watched more than one million times. And that, although calligraphy has long been seen as a dying art. Ironically, it's technology that's helped bring calligraphy back. And social media has certainly helped facilitate this renewal of interest in calligraphy. Um, it's bringing calligraphy to a whole new audience. Um, some of the people following me, they're, they're people who are bus drivers or they're people who are um, school kids in Africa. Lester does a lot of research for his work. He has his own archive of ancient books where he can search for forgotten fonts. Calligraphy is about rhythm and movement, which 15-second videos can capture better than photos. He received a lot of attention by creating hand-drawn copies of famous company logos. He needs about two days of practice before the copy looks identical to the original. Not, it's not high art, those logos. They're, they're, they're fun. They're supposed to be fun little bits of entertaining letter form, you know, design um, and construction. So it's funny that they've um, gained so much weight and gained so much momentum. His huge online success has indeed impacted his life. Now Lester is increasingly putting more focus on art rather than design. And to do that, he's also taking advantage of a computer as well as using pen and ink. He sells his limited edition prints in galleries around the world, as well as on his online shop. There are things that calligraphy tools do very well that digital tools don't, and vice versa. And so I think there's this sweet spot where you can draw on both um, things and produce something that's hopefully very powerful. Because calligraphy is, I mean, to me, it's a very powerful art form. Despite all his artistic ambitions, his global audience can continue to look forward to future calligraphy videos.